Well, we're planning things out. We got the A-frame on the other end. Looking at the board, we're thinking about putting across the top to kind of help support it. Still got to make a couple of A-frames to go in the middle. And hook the wiring to it. We have got all the A-frames put in. And finally figured out how to unwind this roll of wiring. So that we can stretch it across here. And make us a bird covering for our strawberries. It's coming right along. Hopefully we'll be getting her done soon. Been back at it. Getting it done. Getting the fence wire on it. Poultry netting is the official words for it. And what we've done, it's only a little under two foot wide. So it was just shy of making a good seal. So we put a roll down here on bottom. Put a roll on bottom over there. And then Brett's come across the top here with one. And he's rolled it down and made sure the end is covered up real good. He's down here on this end. And he is rolled the wire down to the bottom but the middle wire is kind of crossing over to close the center hole and he's stapled we stapled it to on here with the staple gun and so he's making sure everything's covered so the lovely birds in the neighborhood don't get to enjoy the strawberries before we do we also are going to put down um uh, What'd you say, two by tens? Put two by tens around the base. We're gonna put two by tens around this portion right here. This top of the bed, which would be like the base of our doors and stuff. Just to kind of give it a flat surface to sit on. Block the rain. And it'll block the rain, because these are cross ties. And you now you can see they're, they've been removed. They, have holes in them, they've got cracks, they've got splits, so we're going to seal the top of it up with two by tens. And so this frame will actually set on top of a two by ten. We've been out here a lot of it. But he's about to finish this end, and we're going to make another and just like it to go on the other end. We are back at it. As you can see, we've got both frames done, wire done on both sides. But because we have a little extra here overlapping, Brett's been weaving the wire that came as the tie on the uh, fencing, the netting. It comes all tied up with wire. He's, several feet of that wrapped around it. We thought we'd put it to good use. So he's been using that to sew it in. He was going to show y'all how he does this. I ain't saying it's the right thing to do, but it's using more that came with it. We didn't have to buy no metal clips to pin it together. And so he takes it. He just gets him a start in place. And twist it together somewhere to get started. This ain't done yet, so. Basically just weave it. Weave like it back and forth and kind of make it fill in where the seam is. It'll kind of follow the seam if you get it pretty close. It's starting out a little rough, but there it's, it don't really show that much. A little tweak in here and there. Almost like sewing material. But every other one will lapse over. And one of them I'll just go across. Pull it tight. It looks like it was meant to be there.
Don't make a bad looking scene. No. Nope. That's why this all of them's done but this one. That's the last one there. This is the last one. We thought we showed him what he's been doing. That's how I tie them together anyway. Yep. You can usually buy clips at a big hardware store that you can just crimp them on there. But we seen the bar and thought, well, why not use it? We don't have a big hardware store, so we'd have to travel somewhere to get it. We just use what we got at hand. They're both built and they're both ready to go. We've got our two pretends. We don't have them on there yet. But they're stacked over here on the side. We've got to put our hinges on and our boards around it. But they're heavy enough. Our boxes will stay on top anyway. Our wire covered little boxes. As you call them, our little teepees. Our little rooftops. It took quite a bit of time to tie the wire together and make everything look pretty neat. But I think it'd be well worth it. We got some good looking berries in there. We got to protect. Hope this was a good video for somebody to watch. Maybe inspire them to do something or do something better. Hope you enjoyed and God bless.